Hello, and welcome to another production from the Technology Training Team, a department of the Prince George's County Public Schools IT Division. Today, we're going to talk about Clever. When it comes to digital learning, there are so many services and websites that students are required to use. It can be difficult to keep track of them all. So Clever is a service that collects all those services and resources into one place tailored for each grade level and provides access to them all using the student's PGCPS login. To access Clever on a computer, you need a web browser, but it can be any browser. If you're on a Windows PC, it could be Edge or Internet Explorer. If you're on a Mac, it could be Safari. It could also be Chrome or Firefox, which work on any computer. Once you open the web browser, click the address bar. Then type clever.pgcps.org. If you are using a Chromebook, you can also access Clever by typing in the address clever.pgcps.org, just as we showed you a moment ago on a computer. If you are using a PGCPS-issued Chromebook, you can also click the PGCPS bookmark folder in the toolbar, then click Clever. To access Clever on a PGCPS-issued iPad, touch the Clever Web Clip icon on the home screen. You may also see a second app icon on your home screen simply called Clever. For the purposes of this tutorial, we will focus only on the Web Clip version right now. Regardless of the device you are using, once you access the Clever portal, there are two ways to log in. The first is to use the student username and password. To learn more about student logins, please see the separate video on registering and resetting student passwords. To log in, click the Login with Active Directory button. Enter the PGCPS username and password, then click Sign In. To simplify the login process for younger students, your school may have distributed authentication badges to students. Each badge uses a quick response or QR code that is unique for every student and works in the same way as a username and password. To use the badge, click Clever Badge Login. The first time you use the badge, your device may ask for permission to use your camera or webcam. You will need to grant camera permission to use the badge. Hold the badge up to the camera. Once it has scanned the badge code, click Login. Once you log into Clever, you see icons for each teacher page assigned to the student. Click a teacher icon to view a list of apps, online textbooks, and other resources chosen by that teacher. Below the teacher icons, you see PGCPS links, which offers general tools such as Google Classroom and PGCPS Zoom. To learn more about these applications, please see the related videos. Toward the bottom of the page, you see a section for textbooks. It is important to note that just because the application is visible in this section, that doesn't mean the student has access to it. In this section, you can also find a link to the SchoolMax Family Portal, where you can view attendance and grades. To learn more about SchoolMax Family Portal, please see the related video. If there are any resources you use regularly, simply click the heart icon that appears when you hover over the resource. This adds the resource to your custom favorites list, which appears at the top of the page for easier access. And that's the basics of Clever. This has been another production from the Technology Training Team with additional language support provided by the Translation Office. Thanks for watching.